Today is February 3rd, and we are learning the first lesson over simplifying expressions, part one. There are three components, directions, lesson and check for understanding quiz, and the summary. Let's look at the directions, if it ever loads up. We will simplify algebraic expressions. I will name expression using algebra tiles, pictures, and words. So this lesson is a little different. It's a, not a Canvas quiz. It's a more of a Google Doc. So can you simplify expressions? If you cannot load up this Google Doc below here, again, if it ever loads up, I'm not sure what's wrong with my internet. Um, we can load up this worksheet right here. You know what? I'm just going to load up the worksheet. Probably it's faster than doing that. So what does the worksheet entail? It has symbolic representation. Then you have tile, which you will be pulling from here to draw it, and then verbal description. So is there another way to say x minus 5? So x and negative x are called variables. They are symbols that could be representing a number, any number. Um, so another way we could say is negative 5 plus x. So that's another way we could write it. We can draw it with an x and five negatives. And then you can say x minus five, the difference of x and five, and so on. Um, yeah. Oh, here it is. So if you click on here, you can see it will load up. And here you can write here. To make it larger, I highly recommend you do the following. It says right here, Make sure you zoom 100% to make it easier to view. So the zoom is right here. You click on the zoom, and you click on 100% or 200%. So you can type your answer here. Then you can drag these rectangles. A, a quick way is to call Control-C on your keyboard. You can copy and paste it. Control-Z, C to copy, Control-V to paste it. When you're done with that, um, let's click next to continue. You'll see a summary statement um, of what we are doing today. So it says simplify expression part one summary. And there are two anchor charts. And then there's a video of me. And there's a GT activity that's completely optional. So the main thing is um, algebraic expression. It has a variable like 3 plus x equal 4. Evaluate me, find the value. And then what we're going to be learning today and tomorrow is how to combine like terms.